beg. You are a very wicked man. Don't, don't you understand that one? I so beg. you and I refuse to pay me my house Because see, of what? Listen to me. I said this time. How do you do? No. Get out. Oh yeah, everybody. Now, listen, listen, listen. I promise you. I'm you expecting you something. You're expecting what? As you are expecting nothing. You have nothing to expect. Uh, Every month you are expecting. Next month you are expecting. Expecting something that never came. Uh, you, 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 what are you, you doing? You come. You back come. out of my house. Listen, that is you, you, my house. Come. you come. I beg you. No. Maybe, maybe you, when you go to that person. Listen now. My friend. Come. Oh, come oh see, I beg you. I beg you. See, come out. Come. Bring them out. Oh, yeah, they will bring it down. Bring it down. You protect this thing back. You protect this thing back. Give me the key. What kind of bond is this? Don't do like this now. Bring everything. 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 Bring just for a couple of days, come here, I beg. Something I'm 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 something I'm
Mama Where my money? Mama Chima. See, where my money? So they only want pack out. No, be so. What do you mean, no, be so? I just tell you when come, say, I leave this house. I'm not planning. Where my money? I'm not planning. See, okay, wait. Okay, wait. No time, say, one pack out. Where your money? I'm not planning. 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 I'm going to take my fridge, go. I'm going to take my fridge. 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 See, not try again. Now, woman, I do. What do you mean? I don't like say one bit woman. What do I have? She's not a catchy, the fight woman. I beg you. I'm not a fight. See, I beg you. You're an ungrateful person. You wicked. I beg you. I beg you. I don't like bushes. No, 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 no I want to be this one. I want to be this one now. Come on, come on, now. No, 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 no. I go, I go scribble. They fight woman. She made the catch. They only, they only the ginger me. Come out for this food. This food, this food don't go anywhere. She say don't hurt me. What you gonna say me? Come on, now for this fridge. Come on, now for this fridge. If you near me, if you near me, I hug. They all, they all no fee pay. Thief. As much as Vivian's space is smaller and everything. All those bigger spaces are telling me no, 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 no. She's the only option I've got now. I just call her. I'll call her before no can't carry everything for this place, no. Yeah, hello, hello. Um, are, are you at the shop? I would like to come see you. Yeah, I want us to talk. Okay, I'll be there in a bit. Okay, go forward, go. Come. I'll keep this thing for the first time. I'm going to come take myself. When temptation brought you down, I was there. When conditions were not really bad, you knew. I'm so sorry about that, babe. Shit happens. But why didn't you call me? Why didn't you tell me? I would have given you some money. Instead of letting the landlord kick you out. I, I just didn't want to stress you out, that's why. Babe, stress me? How can you even say that? Don't say that. You know it wouldn't have stressed me. I would have helped you. So, what are you going to do now? Do you have a place to stay? No, I actually don't. Every single person I called is not willing to help. They are all telling me no. Do you mind staying at my place? She wouldn't mind I'm moving with you. No, as long as you don't mind. Wow, um, how, how long am I allowed to squat with you? For as long as you want, babe. Aren't you able to get on your feet? Wow, oh, you do that for me. Of course. You're welcome. So, where are your stuff? They are outside the apartment. You know what, just uh, give me a moment. Let me round up what I'm doing. Then we'll just go and get your stuff and take it home, okay? Have you eaten? Fine. You sure? Do you want some fish? Come on. Trust me. Don't worry. Don't think about it too much. Everything will be all right, okay? Make yourself comfortable. This is not your first time. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Uh, feel at home, okay? You know you're not a stranger here. Yeah. And I hope you can manage this my small space. Uh, sure. Actually, I really do appreciate it. Thank you. You're welcome. So I'll just make some space for your stuff in the wardrobe and then for the rest of the things, so figure out what to do with them later. Uh. Uh, 
I'm sure you must be very hungry. No, due to the whole pressure and everything that's been happening all day, I've never lived of food. Well, you still need to eat something. I would actually love that, but um, out of cash. Have this, okay? There's this woman that owns a book down the street. She's an evil woman, and her or her soup <laughs> is to die for. <laughs> Just go there and eat something, okay? When I come back from the market, I'll make you something special. Sure. Don't worry, okay? Don't think about this, okay? I'm here for you. All right. Cool. Thank I you love so you. much. I love you too. Thank you. All right. Make yourself comfortable, kids. Just make yourself comfortable. See you soon, okay? Thank you. You're welcome.
put you to lean on. I was a shelter hit the way. All your burdens, I took the mad on things, and I you and play for life. See the way you just to pay me. Mama, this, this is good. Really? Mm. <laughs> Is it really that good? Mm -mm. Oh, is yeah, I already put all my finger for mouth. <laughs> mm. Stop making me laugh, this pepper. <laughs> I'm really enjoying it. I'm glad you are. So, I hope you don't mind me asking. What? What's your plan? My plan? Yes, you said that there's this contract you're pursuing. What's up with it? Um, so the thing is, I've, I've sent proposals to literally almost every construction company in town. They're all saying they're going to reverse back, so I'm just waiting on them. How about you link up with some contractors? Maybe they can help. Contractors? Mm -hmm. I beg, you know, it's everyone for himself, God for us all. Mm -hmm. They are all looking out for themselves, so no one is actually going to put you first because everyone sees our competition. So, yeah. yeah. I understand. And I have, I, have, I have a few sites I want to check out, but you know, the issue is the fact that I don't even have money to afford that dead car of mine. Um, you know what? Don't worry about that. I'll support you with it, okay? I'll keep supporting you until you get back on your feet. How about that? Why? Why what? Why? Why are you this good to me? Because you're my man. Hmm? And I love you so much. Besides, I'm 100% sure that if I were in your shoes, you would do the same. Right? Of course, I will. <laughs> Thank you very much. Don't mention it. It's 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 I'm finishing the meat. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I love home cooked meals. They're the best. Baby, babe, please come to bed. I beg you to please get rid of whatever that is bothering you. Please. I just feel like I'm inconveniencing you. What? Please don't say that. You're not inconveniencing me. Please come to bed. You know, you, you have a very beautiful heart. And I love you for that. And I love you too. Let's sleep again. Dreams. Dreams.
this anymore. Anymore. You even to die and leave me. I can't take it anymore. I don't even think about me. Do you, do you think killing yourself will solve your problem? Let me have it. No. Oh, okay. You Let me to, end it all. If you want to end it, then I'll drink it first. I will both die. Yes. No. You don't mind it's my for. fight alone. Let no, me go. It's our fight. You don't need this, baby. Look at me. It's going to be all right. For how long? How long? These frustrations and everything. How? I can't believe you wanted to end it all. Baby, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Come, get up. Please. Get up. Get up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please. 
It's okay. It's going to be alright, okay? Okay, I'm going to take it again. It's fine. Oh my goodness. Be please eat some. It's just a little. Just Be please. Just me up. Listen, you have to cheer up, okay? Everything will be okay. You don't know that. You're right, I don't. But what I do know is no condition is permanent. For how long? It's okay. It's okay. I'll be here, okay? At least you have me, okay? Hey, babe. Oh, so tired today. How was your day? Not good. Is everything okay? Did you go to the site to pursue the contract you told me about? I did. Okay. Same old story. I honestly don't know how much I'm willing to take at this point. I keep getting calls from my family with regards to my mom's health. They need money for medication. And I have nothing left in my account. I have several kubo in my account. Yes. Thank God for you. If not, I'll probably have starved to death by now. Or worse, killed because I had to steal to eat. God forbid. Don't say that, okay? Everything will be all right. When? Ah, babe, no, 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 don't do that. Please, just calm down, okay? Everything will be fine, I promise you. Some engineers at the work site today. You know, anytime I come around, then they look at me like I'm some sort of pauper because I'm not dressed as fancy as them. I'm not in fancy clothes, I'm not in fancy shoes. Today, one of them actually asked me if I'm sure I'm an engineer or I'm a worker on the site. Exactly, because I do not look like one. The humiliation, the frustration, I can't take it anymore. It's okay, babe, look at me. Just look at me. It's going to be okay, I promise. Do not make promises you can't keep. When did your family call for your mom's um, treatment funds? 
this afternoon. Jesus. You know what? Don't worry yourself about it, okay? Um, let me quickly go to the bus stop and get something. I'll be back shortly. It's okay. Please, I beg you, don't do anything stupid. Just wait for me, okay? I'll be back shortly. Thank you so much for the food. I really enjoyed it. Um, yes, I did. Uh, uh, Rumi, there's something I would like to ask of you. I need some money and it's urgent. What do you need money for? My mom has been sick and I need to take her to the hospital. How much do you need? 50,000 Naira. 50,000 Naira. Is it that serious? Yes, it is. I promise I'll pay you every penny. You know I can't say no to you. Thank you. You know when I get home, I'll do the transfer. Okay? Really? Yes, I will. Oh, thank you so much, my dear friend. Yeah, really. <laughs> thank you. Uh, I really appreciate it. I promise I'll pay back in no time. Fine. I promise. It's, it's fine. Thank you. All right. Call me when you get home. All right, I will. Bye. You know, you really didn't have to go this far. It's fine. You know, you have to look the part so that when you're having your meeting with these rich men, they'll take you seriously. Mm, this is so fine. You look good in black. You know what? Um, try this one. This is my favorite. It's colorful. Let me help you. Okay. Salve. Here you go. Try this one. Looks nice. Expensive slightly. Savvy. Put the check down. Uh-uh. It's a boyfriend now. It's a person hot wall. I beg stop everything you blush. Can your boyfriend ever <laughs> say can't? Looks so good. By the time you have this meeting with the rich men. Nobody's going to ask you, oh, are you an engineer or just a construction worker? Let me see that. So good. Ah, one more thing. Here you go. This is 20,000 Naira for your mom's medication. Have it. You take the money, it's okay. Honestly, you surprise me each and every single time. I, I don't know what to say or do or how I'm going to repay you for this kindness. Okay, you don't have to. It's fine. Thank you. I really appreciate it. It's okay. Okay, it's going to be all right. Looks so good. You're welcome. Wait, 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 wait. The white. This is going to look so good.
Babe, babe, are you in there? That's strange. Where could he have gone to? Uh, let's see if he left a message or something. Uh, no miss call, no message, nothing. That's one like him. I know he doesn't go a day without checking up on me, but this is quite strange to me. Try his number. Well, I'm so tired. Uh, not reachable. How come? Why did he go to buy food at the Buka? Going on. Did he? It's, just, it's not possible, it's like a sight. I hope nothing bad has happened. I'm beginning to feel funny about this. Maybe, maybe I should just go and look for him at the Buka and into the street and see. Could you have gone to? I've checked the book and it's not there. That's the only place I know that you could probably would have gone to eat. How reachable. What is going on? I, I hope nothing bad has happened to Victor. Who was he robbed? Did he take his phone? It's not like him not to have called by now all day. Oh Jesus Christ. I still service. Out of service? Where? Now I'm worried. Oh, Jesus. What do I do? What do I do? Should I go to the site? It's late. It cannot be by... He can't be there by this time. Oh, this is just... This is so annoying. going on? Where are you? Where are you? God, now we trouble. This is too much. This is getting out of hand. I'm not finding this funny anymore, Victor. Oh God, who do I know? Who do I call? <laughs> How do I explain this? How do I explain that someone goes missing while in my house? I hope he's safe. Victor. Just don't do this to me. Please don't do this to me. Please don't do this to me. Oh. Who do I know to call? Who do I call? <laughs> Babe, you need to stop crying and find something to eat. I'm sure he's going to come back. When? Um, when? It's been a week already. What if something bad happened to him? Hey, 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 don't think in that direction. Nothing will happen to your man. Okay? How? His number hasn't been connected. Wherever he is, there's no network. So, what do you make out of that? Hey, probably he's somewhere where there's no network. That doesn't mean something bad has happened to him. I don't know. I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this. Don't worry. Anyway, you have to find something to eat, okay? You can't continue like this. You have all sound. I just want him to come back. Stop this. crying. It's okay. He'll come back. Okay. Stop crying. I'm 
smell for me. Okay, you come back. Just calm down. Okay. Please. Your fish is born in sauce. Huh? Thank you. You're welcome. What brings you here? How are you? I'm just hanging in there. I can see how my dear friend is doing. Any word from Victor yet? Not a word. Okay, have you tried calling his friends or colleagues? I called the ones I know. They don't seem to know his whereabouts. I didn't tell you if he was traveling out of town or... No. Oh, that's quite strange. I'm just scared. I'm scared that maybe something bad happened to him. I know my man. There's no way he would have traveled without telling me. He doesn't even go a day without calling to know how I'm doing. That's why I'm so scared. It's okay. Stop crying. Come. Come. It's okay. Everything will be fine. I'm thinking maybe I should go to the police and file a missing persons report. The police? Yes, I have to find my man. I can't just sit here and do nothing. At least if I go to them, they'll look for him. Then I'll expect either good or bad news. Don't worry. Everything will be fine. He will come back safe and sound. As for going to the police to file a report, do you think is necessary? He probably went for a job with his colleagues. You think so? I know so, but maybe something came up and he didn't have enough time to call you. Or maybe his phone died. Okay, you know what? If you don't see him after a few days or weeks, then you can go and meet the police. Okay? Your fish is burning. Jesus. Sit down. Sorry. It, are you okay? Everything is not okay. What happened? Talk to me. Tell me. They found Victor. Jesus, where? Where? I don't know. It's, it's too heavy for me to say. You should come and see for yourself. Is he okay? Is he alive? Please take me to him once. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Your fish. Yes, my fish. Yes. yes. Are you sure he's fine, right? He's, he's okay. Jesus. But why? Yeah. Don't worry, I'll take you there. Just let's go. When temptation brought you down, I was Hurry. When conditions were really bad, you knew me. I was a shoulder for you to lean on. I was a shelter hit the way. All your burdens I took the med on things and I you and pay for life. Madam, hmm? some people just come from sites, they want to see your girl. Mm -hmm. From the sites? Yes. Okay, bring them in. Mm. Yes, young ladies, who are you? Vivian. Mm -hmm. Vivian? Sure. You two know each other? He's a boyfriend. Let's go, yes, I think so. Yes, babe. He said you should leave. Please leave. leave. You are smelling all over this place. Your fish smell, babe. If you are still your work Don't you understand English? He said you should leave. Okay, oh Take your smelly self out of this place. Not even an explanation from you. He owes you no explanation whatsoever, my dear. So take your smelling fish self out of this place. You are polluting my house with fish smell. I can't take it. You 
You're going to stand here, watch her humiliate me. Vivian, you are the only one humiliating yourself right now. If you had left like I told you to leave, no one would tell you anything. So just go. After, After what? I stood by you and the whole world abandoned you and this is how you want to pay me back? So wait, you want me to give you my soul? Because what, you rendered me hope when I was down? <laughs> Did you say it little? Of course, it is little. And come to think of it, I didn't even ask for it. If memory serves me right, you were the one that asked if I wouldn't mind staying with you. You know, I didn't want you to feel bad. That's why I accepted. Wait, 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 let me understand this. Did you think that I was going to marry you because you made me stay in that handcuff of yours? Don't do this you are an ingrate! Listen. I stood by you! I provided for you! I made you stop committing suicide! Did you bring her there? You so, me. I would actually do what? Repay you of your charity or what? So, wait, how much? How much more? Send me your account. Is it cash or? Send me your account. Let me send you. How much? 50,000? How much more? 100,000? Just send me your account. Report to Zo. <laughs> Listen, enough of all this telenovela bullshit. You need to leave now. No. Take your fish smelly self out of this place. No. Get you out of this house. Please. Get out. Get out. Please. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. You live what you saw, I pressed you. Come on, fish out. Okay. If I say I'm not going to do that again, you'll be like what I'm going to do. You'll be like what I'm going to Oh my god. Come <laughs> By seeing other people here again. That's not what I'm saying, like I told you. Come, babe. Come, let's <laughs> this thing don't cast. Hi. Just do one. When conditions were really bad, you knew me. I was a shoulder for you, Selena. I was a shelter hit the way. All your burdens, I took the mad on things, and I you and pay for life. See the way you just to pay me less. So this is who you are. Um, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. I'm sorry. I, 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 I want to take something. Danny. What are you thinking about? I'm thinking about you. I'm wondering why you came to my house this early morning to taunt me. <laughs> Sorry, heavy gate. I'm, <laughs> I'm moving. What do you mean by you're moving? Well, I got transferred to our headquarters in Abuja, so I'm relocating. Wow. Congrats. I, I didn't see that coming. You know, you're my only friend here and family. Now that you're leaving, what would I do with my life? You can come with me. What? Yeah, it's actually a good idea. You can come with me. Are you being serious? You need a new environment. But I have a life and a business here. Uh -huh. Vivian, Abuja is a very big city. You can continue your fish business there. Who knows, you might even see something better. I make a switch. I don't think it's a good idea. It means I will start life afresh. Oh, so do you prefer bumping into your ex and his fiance in every corner of the streets? You need a fresh start. A new environment. A new business. You can't keep relieving of this pain. So if I relocate, where would I stay? <laughs> I have a new house and a car. A car? Yes. I mean, I work for one of the top construction companies in Abuja. Nice. But 
How will I move my properties? What will I do with them? You sell it. What? Yes. Sell every property that you once shared with that animal called Victor. Everything that reminds you of him. Then you use the money to get a new property. Not that you'll be needing it anyways, because I have a furnished two-bedroom apartment waiting for arrival. Hmm. So what do you think? Uh, okay, let's do this. Yes. I promise you, you will not regret it. I, I hope so. Uh, so when are you leaving? Well, we'll be moving in a couple of days. But first of all, let me call someone that will help market your properties. Thank you so much, Omi, and congratulations. Thank How would you. I do without you? You're okay, actually. Let me make that call. It's very important. I'm very glad that you are going to join me here in Abuja. There is nothing wrong in starting on a fresh slate. Whatever happened in the past remains in the past. It's time for a new beginning, devoid of every disappointment. Set your eyes on your goals and achieve it. This house is big enough to accommodate us. It's a two bedroom flat. And as a senior staff in my company, I will ensure that we lack nothing, okay? Umi, thank you. You've always been so supportive of me. I appreciate you and all the effort you have put into making me happy and better. I don't even know how. Begin to thank God on your behalf. You're truly a friend that everyone should have. It's okay. Thank you so much. I don't even know how to begin to beg God to bless you. Okay. You see, this is your new position. It's just the beginning of anything good that God has in stock for you. Amen. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for loving a stranger. Thank you for making me your sister. I really appreciate you. Thank you so much. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Clean your tears. It's okay. It's okay, smile for me. All right, enough of the tears. Cheers to you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm ruining the moment. It's okay. So, cheers to friendship. Thank you. You're welcome. Drink up, drink up. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'm ready. Why are you tying scarf like a Pentecostal sister? Like a bone again? I don't understand. I thought you wanted me to drop you off at work then help you drop your car at uh, mechanic. Is that why you're tying scarf? Please remove this scarf. Uh -huh. your, your future husband might see you. Do you want him to see you looking okay? So tying scarf is now being untidy? Yes, you need to always look good. And hurry up and leave. Hurry up, please. I'm ready late. Ah, it's just mm -hmm. oh, better. See if that is well. Okay.
Where's the address to the mechanic again? Uh -uh. She forgot her file. Your file. Yes, I'm, I'm I mean, outside. Come, come on. on. You can't be always okay. right. Of course, I'm always right. I'm a mother. We are always right. Alright, that's fine. We'll talk when you get back from work. Bye. Mothers. As, excuse me. I'm sorry. I, I don't mean to interfere. I just have a little tip for you. Don't ever argue with your mother. Mothers are always right. Alright, um... Thank you so much. Anyways, are you the new staff that was transferred from the Lagos branch? No, no. My friend is. Thanks for the tip. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah, welcome. <clears throat> You're always forgetful. There you go. Yeah. How did you manage to get my boss to say hi to you? That's your boss? Yes. Oh, I didn't know. You know what, just um, let me rush to the mechanic, okay? Alright, see you at home. I'll see you. Bye. 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 Right, bye. You're back. Welcome yes. home. What are you doing with the laptop? Oh, um, I'm writing an application and preparing my CV. <laughs> Thank God, someone has finally decided to use her university results. Polytechnic result. And it's not like I have not tried applying for jobs before in the past. But all the companies that I got interviewed they didn't even give me a call back or got them back to me. So. <laughs> Don't worry, it's going to be different out here, okay? I hope so. Uh, my boss gave me something to give to you. Your boss? Yeah. Yeah. What, what's in there? I don't know. I didn't open it. Okay. Why did you laugh? Oh, nothing. It's just something that we were talking about earlier. Okay. Seems like he added his number. Yes, he did. Hmm. Hope you'll give him a call. I don't know. What do you mean by I don't know? Isn't that the reason why he sent his number to you? Is it? Ah, uh, you know what? I'll just finish up this up, okay? Welcome back. You should call him. Uh, sorry. This girl, she never seems to amaze me. <laughs> when are you willing to give him a chance? Can you stop being loose, please? So you are keeping things from me? So tell me, what did he say? He likes you, isn't it? Mm, well, he wants to get to know me. That's new. What's new? Daniel being interested in any woman. 
he is single? A hundred percent single. Mm. How come? Cool. I mean, he's successful. He's handsome and rich. How can such a man be single? Daniel is very picky. He has a type and luckily we seem to be his type. I doubt that. You know what? This morning was the first time I saw him talking to a woman. Well, maybe he just wants to use me and dump me. What? Isn't that what they all want? Please, Daniel is different. Mm, I hear you. They are all different. Until they're moving with you, take your money, disappear without a word. Good night. Good night. But you and the whole world abandoned you, and this is how you want to pay me back? So, wait, you want me to give you my soul? Because what? You rendered me hope when I was down. <laughs> Did you say it little? Huh? Of course, it is little. And come to think of it, I didn't even ask for it. If memory serves me right, you were the one that asked if I wouldn't mind staying with you. You know, I didn't want you to feel bad. That's why I accepted. Wait, 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 let me understand this. Did you think that I was going to marry you because you made me stay in that hand cup of yours? Oh, no, 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 no. I can't call him. What's the point? I'm not his type. I'm not even on the same level of class. How can I even offer him aside my body? Which is what he maybe wants. No, 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 no. Just respect myself and go to sleep. I can't take another hard boy. I can't. There's, there's no point starting this. Fine, how was work today? It was fine, thank you. <sighs> so, my boss sends his message again. Uh, again? Mm -hmm. So, are you going to open it to see what's inside? I already know what's inside. How sure are you? Okay, I'll show you. Okay. He is wondering why I didn't respond to his message the last time and is hoping that I'll call him this time around because he can't wait to hear from me. So, are you still going to call him? I'm still thinking about it. Mm -hmm. I see that you're playing on tickets. Shall I don't read too much? I'm going to marry him to end. <laughs> Welcome back. Thank you. How was your day? Fine. How was your work? Fine. Stressful. What can I do? <laughs> Sorry, hard worker. <laughs> My boss sent his message again. Again? Yeah. Oh, she's impressed. Aren't you going to read it? What's the point? It's the same thing that he has been saying for the past two weeks that he's likely going to say in there. So, how is that? Look. Mm 
that guy clearly likes you. That man barely pays attention to any woman. For the past two weeks, he has been trying to get your attention. And you're ignoring him. Why? I don't know. Okay. Don't you want a man to treat you right? Who doesn't want a good man? So why are you pushing me away someone that is making an effort? Because I am scared, Omi. I don't want to go through that pain again. You know what happened. You know my story. After everything I did for Victor, he took him in, I brought him into my home, I changed his wardrobe, I loaned money from you and other friends just to support him. I did all that and he still left without a word. You saw what he did to me, the embarrassment and the humiliation I went through because of him. So need to even pick up and please. So do you think he's going to turn out to be another Victor? That's not what I'm saying. I thought the whole point of moving to Abuja is to have a fresh start. I don't want to repeat the same mistake again. Daniel is just a bloody opportunist that saw a way out and took it. Are you aware that when you told me that you wanted to go to the police to file a missing persons report and I told you to hold on, I asked a few questions about him. I spoke to a few people in the building construction field and luckily for me, I met his friend Ken who told me his escapades. Wait, it was Ken who told you where to find him. Victor is now in your past. Let us concentrate on the present. Victor and Daniel are two different people. I've worked with Daniel's company starting from Lagos and every member of his staff, including people outside his company, has something good to say about him and his family. Daniel is one boss in the construction world that treats his staff with so much respect. Despite the money that he has or connection, he still treats them with so much respect he doesn't discriminate. I think you should give him a chance. Don't let your past relationship ruin your chance of meeting someone good. I'm your very good friend and I want the best for you. Okay, well. Daniel is one boss that everyone in the construction world talks about. How he's very respectful of his staffs, even with all his wealth and connections. He still treats his staffs with so much respect. He doesn't discriminate whatsoever. I don't think he'll regret giving someone like that a chance to get to know you, Vivian. Think about it. And don't let your past experience hold you back from receiving a kiss from God to you. Hi. Hey. No surprise, it's you. Do you have a minute? I would like to have a talk with you. Sure. Um, it's my lunch time. You want to join? Okay.
that her reason for blowing me off? Yes. Truth is, I... I also want to get to know you. But I'm just scared. I'm scared that I might fall in love with you and you will not love me back and you end up hurting me and breaking my heart. Vivian, nothing like that will happen. Look, from the very first day I saw you, I knew you were my wife. Okay, and I promise I'll not let anyone hurt you again. Not even you. Not even me. Vivian, look, I really care about you. Why you barely even know me? I know, it's true. I barely know you. We barely know each other, but that's what I want. I, I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Yes, I... I can't... I can't... Anytime I close my eyes, it's, it's just you. Seeing you every time in a wedding gown, pregnant for me. Look, that's what I want. And look, I promise I'm willing to take this very slow. One step at a time, no pressure. Okay, can I at least think about it? Do you want to think about it? Yes. Okay, that's, that's, that's fine by me. You know what, I I can't wait to tell my mom I finally found a wife. <laughs> so sad. How could you do this to me? I did nothing to you, Ken. So it's true what they say about you. Rumors are for losers. You're supposed to be my friend. Yet you betrayed me because of this ordinary contract. <laughs> Ken, Ken, Ken. You and I know that there's nothing ordinary about this contract. You think you've won a lottery? She's a spoiled brat. And you will definitely regret this your act of betrayal. You better watch your mouth. Or I'll make them make you watch it. Listen, man. It won't be too long from now. She'll dump you just the same way she did to me. Once she get bored of you, she'll dump you and jump into the nice exciting guy. <laughs> wow, sorry to bust your bubbles, Ken. But unlike you, I know how to keep the passion in my relationship burning. I'm not as boring as you, bro. Take a book or two from that. We shall see. Man, get out of this place! Not ready. Um, How long will it take you to prepare something for me to eat? Are you even good at anything? Or you think he's sleeping with me that makes you a man? <laughs> My dear, it's not a big deal. Oh. It's not a big deal. Sex is very, very cheap. And I have all it takes to get as many men as I want. Okay? You have to learn to be grateful. I pay the bills in this house. I accommodate you. I even get you jobs. What more do you want? Eh? Hey, you have to learn to be grateful. You have to appreciate me. You have to thank me, applaud me for, for, for taking you off the streets. You are beginning to irritate me. Just get out. Just leave my sight, please. You are irritating me. Be careful. 
I hurry up with the food. Uh -uh. I walk, walk, walk. I will come to the house and I will still starve again. How long will it take you? Hurry up, oh! When temptation brought you down, I was there. When conditions were really bad, you knew me. I was a sort of forgive I was a shot I hit the way. All your burdens I took them head on things and I do and pay for life. Say the way you just to pay me less. So this is who you are easy. I was a shoulder for you to lean on. I was a shot I hit the way. All of your burdens, I took them head on things and I go and be for life. Baby, baby, I thought you loved me too. Uh, all right. Say, baby, all right. Fine. Uh, all right, what's my bag looking for here? Okay, I don't know. Where are my hand? I don't know where she go. I'm a girl, I'm a girl, I'm a girl, what's your hurry do for you? Okay, I don't know where she go, but she said my collect key for honey if you come back. The customer you're trying to reach is not available. Please call back. <laughs> so good. The customer you're trying to reach is not available. Please call back. <laughs> Operation failed. You see what I'm doing now? No, 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 Ha! Ha! Okay, give me the khaki, baby. Quick! See, if you get me, I'll, 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 I'll. Don't concern me now. I don't know. It's not like khaki for your hand. Okay, baby, give me the khaki, baby. Okay, baby, give me the khaki, baby. See, if you get me, I'll go. Get everything. See, I'll go put that gate. I'll put that gate. I'm going to open it for you. Just give me the car. Send me the clothes you want from me. I'm going to open the gate. I'm going to open this by the box. Oh, my God. Give me the car. Give me the skin. Oh, my God. Give me the skin. Oh, my God. Can I have fun? I don't have to tell you that I say no, I ain't that. Mr. Victor, these are the rules they gave me. Why are you asking us to do that I'm the one in charge of this? I don't want to lose my job. What you don't want to use it? Hey! My friend! Ah! Ken! Oh! My ex-friend! <laughs> I heard what happened between you and your woman. I heard your contracts have been revoked. How come? How come you're not boring? How did you let the sweet passion of your relationship burn out? <laughs> my friend, all the engineers have heard about it. And we are all waiting to have you tell us how the most exciting man in the whole universe failed in keeping up his excitement. He's unfortunate you've lost your job. My condolence. Take now. <laughs> See you soon. How the fuck did she tell everyone that I'm sorry? I'm sorry. What is going on? I thought you lost well. I'm assuming you go now. Everyone has heard about it. She couldn't even keep this breakup a secret. No, 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 no. I cannot be the mockery of this town.
Yeah. Tomorrow. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to do it tomorrow. Because I have nothing left here. You know, I, I sold my car. I'm in debt, bro. I have nothing to live for here. Such so environments will really do me good. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Well, thanks again. Bro, you need to cheer up. How was your flight? Yeah, it was cool, it was cool, it was okay. You know, these people, they can be crazy at times. Yeah. The government actually needs to put in measures to help keep this unnecessary delays and rescheduling of flights, if you ask me. If you sanction here and there, they will adjust, trust me. <laughs> Guys, see, <coughs> it wasn't like I was eavesdropping or anything. Okay. But then, I actually had your conversation with your friend at the airport with regards to the Empire Construction Company. Empire Construction Company? Yeah. You know them? I'm trying to ask me like this. Who doesn't know them? See, I've been trying to get them to register me under their branch in Lagos. But guys, to know of you. For real? I promise you, bro. Guess what? You're in luck right now. <laughs> There's an opening right now, so you can actually register your company or register your name under their company right now. And they give massive contracts. Trust me. They give the biggest contracts to the engineers and building developers that work under them. You know, so. I know this, but guy. What I'm trying to say is, like, you know what? Getting someone, you know, it's like you need someone there to. You know what I'm talking about? No worries, I know a, a few guys that work with them, you know? For you? Yeah. Guys, see, you guys connect with these people. Me, then. <laughs> Assist me, man, register at them. No one, no one. When we get home, you freshen up, get something to eat, I'll call one of them. Thanks, bro. You're, you're welcome, you're welcome. See, this your mother is pinning me. I'm just, you know, I don't want to add to your anger. You're, you know what I'm saying? Because when my ex wife left me, she almost took everything during the divorce. So, I feel you, man. Amen, amen. It's well. Cheer up, cheer up, okay? <laughs> See, uh, you guys, like, I forget to have an interview, but honestly, I'm really excited about this interview. That is why we need to get going. Yeah, yeah. I told you my friends were going to call you. I'm happy for you, okay? Yeah, so. So, when is the interview? It's at 12. If not, I go, don't talk. Where to go? 12. Let's go. Oh, nice. Look, I must say, I am really impressed with your resume. Thank you. And having fast knowledge about this whole construction industry. And thank you for everything you're doing for the local community. <laughs> yes, um, for me personally, I would love to hire you, but I am not the one in charge of hiring. But don't worry, um, the HR is going to work in any moment from now. And whatever she says, okay, it's final. Okay. Okay, so good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you. Baby. Hi. How are you? Um, I'm fine. Yes. This beautiful queen is the HR manager. Okay, and she is my fiance too. She's in charge of hiring and punishing. Okay. So Victor, please do well to impress her. 
She says yes, you're hired. Okay? And um going for the meeting. Okay, I'll see you later. Okay, have a good one, okay? Okay. All the best. Okay, good. Alright. I'll see you. I think I, sh I should leave. What? Um, no. But for what it's worth, I want you to know that I'm truly sorry for what I did to you in the past. I did not deserve your kind heart. Um, wait. You can't just leave like that. Look, I, I know you hurt me in the past. That's true. But I must add, everything worked out for my good. I mean, if you hadn't left me to be with that woman, I probably wouldn't have left Lagos to Abuja and I would not even have met the love of my life, a special gift from God, my fiancé. So you see, I bear no grudge against you. If anything, I owe you a big thank you for stopping me from settling down with someone like you. So why would I hinder your progress? Let's just leave everything and forge ahead. Please, have a seat and tell me why you want to sell what this contract is. You are willing to give me a chance to see if I can actually land this contract. I could literally change my life after everything I did to you. Why not? You see, Victor, we are not the same. I forgive and I move on. Like I said, grudge is one heavy load for someone to be carrying around for so long. It will make you bitter and resentful. Yes, I resented you for a while, but I forgive you. Let's leave the past where it is and talk business. Please have a seat, okay? I'm sorry, I can't. I do not deserve you repaying my unkindness with kindness. I'm sorry. Victor? Victor! <laughs> Hey, mama, can I? Oh. When temptation brought you down, I was there. When conditions were really bad, you knew me. I was a shoulder for you, Selena. I was a shoulder for you. It was shame that she still wanted to be with us. Shame? Well, let's just say pride. He couldn't stand the idea of a common fish seller being his boss. Or maybe just guilt. Yes, I think guilt is the right word to use. He's been mad and he probably feels that he doesn't deserve you being kind to him after everything that he did to you. Or maybe he just couldn't stand seeing another man. A better man than him treats me like a princess, something he couldn't do. <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever his reasons are, will serve as a lesson to him and others is gonna share okay. and others is gonna share his experiences with. Never to take anyone for granted. Because you don't even know what God has in store for the person. Exactly. Babe, you know one thing about God? He has a way of bringing someone from behind and bringing the person to the front. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Let's take a look at David in the Bible. A common shepherd. He became the greatest king of all time. God is still in the business of doing miracles though. <laughs> That's why it's not good to look down on anyone. Even if they cannot offer you anything. Because situation changes, table changes, and miracle happens every day. You never know. I'm sure that you'll find peace wherever I <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. It's very much Okay. I need to show you the new designs of the wedding dresses that I've saved I so far. I can't wait. <laughs> I'm reporting live your maid of honor. I know already. Who <laughs> 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 be if not you? I wonder. <laughs> Vivian, all my life, I have always wanted a woman who will love and appreciate me. Not for what I'm worth, but for what I truly deserve. And you coming into my life, 
you've actually taught me the meaning of love. I will love you forever. And trust me, I am not letting anything come between us. I will love you forever too. I know that I've been through so much and I still have a lot of healing to do. Having you in my life is a sign that I don't even need healing anymore because you complete me. You've shown me so much love, the kind of love I haven't experienced before. I've seen it all. I've tasted both the sweetness and the bitterness of life and I've come to see life from a different perspective now. But you is the most sweetest part and I want to enjoy it for the rest of my life, if you let me. I love you so much. I love you. I love you too. I would be 